Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Quinton here and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to install plugins in Joomla. And if you guys don't know what plugins are then let me just ramble on for about 20 seconds. Um, but basically a plugin is an additional bit of software or uh, additional features that somebody else wrote for Joomla and you can go ahead and install those features as a plugin and actually use them on your site. So chances are whatever you want to do on your website like creating a slider or a gallery or something like that somebody else has probably already written a plugin for Joomla for that and you can go ahead and just install that plugin and uh, you'll be good to go. Okay so I'm gonna show you guys a really useful plugin that I like to use and that is actually the JCE text editor. So in to install that, I actually have to go over to the back end of Joomla and then I need to go over to extensions and extension manager. Okay, now don't freak out if your web page does not look exactly the same as this. Okay, I actually had to click a little button to add install from web over here. Okay, so I think when you first land up on this page, you're going to be landing on the upload package file and there's going to be a little alert box at the top of the page over here that says would you like to add the install from web tab you're gonna go have to go ahead and click on a button and once you've done that you're gonna have this tab over here where you're able to install plugins directly from the web okay so one of the most used plugins for Joomla is actually JCE and what this does is actually um, create a really nice uh, WYSIWYG editor uh, as you can see WYSIWYG uh, that stands for what you see is what you get editor okay and if you guys don't know what a what you see is what you get editor is then let me go over to article manager and I'm gonna open that in a new tab okay and if I open up this article then you'll see we're gonna have a text editor over here so <laughs> Uh, right now I think something must have gone a little bit wrong with Joomla um, but uh, let me go ahead and get that right quickly I probably just have to go over to system global config and change my editor here to tiny mce and the reason why I had to do that was because I actually installed JCE just to test it out a couple minutes ago and then I uninstalled it so that's why I have that problem you guys shouldn't have that problem um, but let's go over to article manager again edit this article and by default Joomla actually comes with this tiny MCE editor which really isn't a great editor it actually strips some tags and like validates your HTML and like it lands up that your um, article over here might not look like you want it to look like uh, because this editor actually takes some of the HTML tags away so paragraphs and headings are fine but uh, there are certain tags that this editor doesn't like and then it just strips them away okay uh, so if you're ever putting divs and stuff in here, it gets really complicated. Okay, and what I'd like to do is actually just uh, get rid of this editor and install JCE. So we're going to go ahead and click on JCE, click the install button, and this should actually run the Joomla install. So this is going to take a couple minutes, but once it's done, Joomla or JCE is going to be installed into Joomla. Okay, and I actually just want to close this article for now. Okay, uh, so just while that was installing, something to do. Okay, and depending on how slow your internet is, this might take a while. Uh, so I'm actually just going to pause this. Okay, it's done. So once the plugin is finished installing, you're going to have a message over here that says the install was complete or completed successfully. Okay and you're gonna have some information about the plugin you just installed which in this case is JCE and a whole bunch of other stuff okay and to check that this worked I can click on components and you can see I've got JCE editor added to my components now if you didn't install this plugin it's not going to appear there until you actually install JCE okay but what I want to do now is actually just go over to my global config 
and I want to change my editor. So the default editor, I want it to be JCE. And if I go ahead and click save and close, that is going to make it so that everyone that logs into Joomla will be using the JCE editor to edit articles or modules uh, in Joomla. So let's go over to my first article over here. And as you can see, we now have a very different editor appearing in our or on our page. Okay, so there's a whole bunch more options over here. If I want to toggle over to view the code, I can go ahead and hit that button. And now we've got uh, our code accessible so we can really easily write code over here as well or just paste code in. That's what I do usually. Okay. And um, taking a look at the front end, uh, obviously there's a lot more buttons here. So it's a lot easier for someone who doesn't know HTML to actually update content on their website. And that's why I really like to install JCE in every single web page or every single website that I do in Joomla. I will always install JCE and pretty much everyone does. That's why it's a very popular plugin. And I'm going to go ahead and click save and close now. And that is actually how to install a plugin in Joomla. And that's all I have for you guys in this video. So don't forget to subscribe. Please feel free to leave a comment, like and share this video. It's really going to help my channel grow. And if you're following this, um, I actually just launched a website called Josie Tuts, which is www.josietuts.com. Go ahead and check that out. I'll leave a link in the description below. And I'd really like you guys to start using my website, Josie Tuts. Cool. And I'll see you guys next time.